evening, and welcome to another episode of Digital Frontier. We're discussing the world of banking, and specifically, the Basel III monitoring exercise that shows the largest global banks are struggling to maintain their pre-pandemic capital ratios. Is this something to be concerned about? On the one hand, we have banks that are increasing their dividend payouts, which could be a sign of financial health, while on the other hand, we see that banks are struggling to meet the liquidity requirements set forth in the Basel III framework. So, what does this all mean for the world economy? Are we looking at another potential financial crisis? And what should the global financial industry do to mitigate these risks? Let's dive a little deeper into the impact of Basel III framework on banks' capital. The report shows that while some banks are struggling to meet the new requirements, others are finding ways to exceed them. What can we learn from the banks that are doing well? Moving on to liquidity requirements, we see that some banks are using the flexibility of the Basel framework to use their stock of high-quality liquid assets during the pandemic period. Is this a smart move, or are they playing with fire? All in all, these are interesting times in the world of banking, and it will be fascinating to see how the industry responds to the challenges ahead. What do you think the banks should do to ensure financial stability in the years to come? Let's start a debate.